Hello everybody, it is time to get the 2021 Carrier 3.5 ton up and running for the 2024 cooling season. I'm going to do the usual, got to vacuum out the bottom there. I see the broad ocean motor is quite rusty. wonder if I could give that a coat of gray paint and make that look a little better. We'll see, see how it goes. And then of course clean the coils and then finish up with a good wash and wax. But before I do anything, time to cut the power. There, now I can get everything set up. I'll get all my tools lined up. And I think what I'm going to do this year is test the capacitor. All right, time to check the capacitor. This is a 45.5. So from the common to the fan. Okay, six microfarads. Compressor, 52.5. That should work. Looks like everything is pushed on pretty well. Don't see any wires rubbing anywhere. Let's go ahead and check the kickstart while I'm in here. It shows to be 189 to 277 microfarads. So that one's actually reading a little bit low, but we'll just pretend we didn't see that. I took a brush and just gave that a quick brush out, all the loose debris and cobwebs and stuff like that. So next in the steps we'll be getting the shop vac out and vacuuming out the base of the unit. Got 
got the shop vac set up. Let's get this debris cleaned out of the bottom. Alright, I got the motor all painted up. Now this next step is completely optional. Just personal preference. I'm taking some metal polish. Polishing out the blades. I have not done this one yet. I have cleaned it, but it's not polished yet. And there's a look at the polished blade. Well now it's time for the coil cleaner. I use this new Calgon Tri-Clean two times concentrate coil cleaner. Not completely necessary, but I need all the cooling capacity I can get, so I'm making sure the coil is as clean as possible. So I'll just follow directions on here, on the bottle, right there, and then rinse it very well because this stuff is quite corrosive. So I'll do a time lapse for this. We're moving right along. Next I'm going to give it a bath inside and out. And again, this is optional.
Well, that's done. Time to let it dry and then give it a wax. Going to be using this Mirror Glaze High Tech Yellow Wax High Gloss Protection. Just what I had handy. Now a little 303 on the wires, UV protectant. A little while later, I'm all cleaned up and waxed up. Put a little 303 on the the uh, electrical line and the insulation of the suction line. Didn't forget to wax the filter dryer. So all back together, nice and clean in there. I waxed the compressor as far as I could reach. Condenser coils are clean. One more thing to do before starting up the AC for the season. Changing the filter. I haven't changed it since I started the heat. Heat didn't run that much over winter. So I don't think it's going to be too terribly dirty. But good practice to go ahead and swap it out. Is the heat still on? It's 77 in here so we're getting real close to needing AC. Well, here's the old one, not the worst I've seen. And here's the new. And that is done. I think it might be ready to do a test start. But that will be in the next video. So once again this has been getting the 2021 Carrier 3.5 ton cleaned up and ready for the 2024 cooling season. Thank you for watching.